Hey guys, Tabrix and guys, today we're going to talk about the new NECA King Kong figure, guys. And this is pretty interesting. Um, this literally just popped up out of nowhere um, a couple weeks ago of a picture of these this figure right here. And it was pretty confusing of that version right there. But we have more information actually about this figure and we got some high-end pictures. So the first thing is the box right here in the front looks okay. Not the biggest amount of it. Um, I do like the parts right there, King Kong, but how the picture they put right there for Kong, not the biggest fan of. Um, here's a picture right here of the back. There's, of course, Kong, and there's some pictures of, of course, more Kong right there. And here's, of course, a picture right here when you open the flap. And that looks pretty cool, actually. I like that color right there where the window's at. I actually like that a lot. Um, you can see the Kong figure right there, and you can, of course, see Kong right there pounding his chest. And here are the better pictures of Kong itself right here, the figure. And I do got to say, um, pretty interesting choice of a Kong repaint right here. Um, pretty confused why they made this one. When I first saw the pictures, I was like, what? What is this? Um, really confused. And from seeing it right here, this is supposed to be from the 1933 poster. And I actually looked at the poster, and to me, it looks nothing like it. Um, there's some parts that does look like it, but there's some parts that really doesn't. Um, right here where Kong shows his um, arm yellow, that's supposed to be the side of him sideways, I'm pretty sure. And of course you see the face right there with different colors. Um, to me it looks okay with some angles. Um, it's just, when you see the face right here, um, there's just a lot of colors, just random colors to me. Um, to be honest, kind of looks like more as a comic book version, to be honest. But the part that doesn't really match too well is like around the chest area, the legs. Um, you see some blue, you see some shade of yellow right there. Um, you could barely notice it, especially on the hands right here too. Like until I look at more of the pictures, you see some blue. Um, but I don't really know what to feel about this Kong figure right here. Um, have some mixed thoughts. There's actually a picture right here of Kong doing like a stance right here. Um, this pose actually looks really cool with the paint actually. It doesn't look too bad. But I don't know if it's worth spending another 30 bucks for a Kong figure. It's just the same thing with a little bit of a repaint that looks okay. And usually with these repaints like this, um, it doesn't look the same as, of course, shown right here. Because there's actually already pictures from a store that are showing it. Like um, probably an employee or something like that. But here's, of course, pictures of, of course, the Kong in hand. And from seeing the pictures, it actually looks really different especially the yellow on of course the eyebrows and from seeing the picture right here the high-end ones it looks different um the mouthpiece right there looks really sloppy actually it looks like he stick his face on a, um, a jar of jelly or something like that and the teeth right here also looks really different um but yeah another thing i just noticed actually there's actually the secondary head scope right there too um from seeing it too from that side yep pretty much the same thing but Yep, and the chest area here too, from seeing the pictures of, of course, the one um, taken a picture by, the chest area looks kind of different compared to the HD pictures right here. I barely see any of the yellow. Do see some pink, but there's also some missing yellow right there, and some supposed to be blue. I don't even see any of the blue. Um, but yeah, and from seeing the pictures right here, there's some light blue also in the paint right there of the hands. Um, I'm trying to check the other hands right here of the spare hands it comes with. Pretty much the same accessories as the last one. It's just a repaint. Um, of course, the secondary head scope of Kong right there. Of, ho of him more yelling, of course. And there's, of course, of a Kong face right here. Him more relaxed. Um, I don't really know if I'm going to pick this one up right here, guys. Um, really don't know. And another thing is actually pretty interesting is that this is actually going to be a Walmart exclusive. And I don't know if this is actually the first um, Walmart exclusive for NECA. I might be wrong with this, but I'm pretty sure this might be. Unless you count the um, Comic-Con ones, they were just randomly at Walmart. That's the only store I can remember. But I don't really know if you count that because I know the Pennywise and sometimes you can find the two-pack of the Batman, the Alien, the Superman, and like that. But this might be the first one. I could be wrong unless you guys can um, remind me. But yeah. And the release date for this one, it says right here, um, early February or March. So that's pretty interesting. Also right there for the release date right there. Um, we can expect it pretty soon. I don't know if this is going to be, of course, pop up on Walmart's website for like a pre-order or anything right now. Um, if there is, of course, post it on my Instagram. But yeah, pretty interesting, of course, design right here of Kong. Um, the price, still don't know either. Um, it could be $24.99 or 20, um, 
$24.99 or $20.99 because I think I saw their NECA figures usually for like $29.99 but their Godzilla ones were $24.99 so give you either one of those prices right there um might pick this up only if I find it early like for an unboxing but that's all um even maybe if it's like $24.99 I should might pick it up because it's a little bit cheaper compared to of course 30 but I will see I might pick it up but that's of course my thoughts for this Kong figure guys. Let me know down below if you guys can pick this up. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye.